Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Next Tutorial. My name is Khalil and in today's video I'm going to be showing you the steps on how to reset your admin password on Windows 7 without any softwares or disks or USBs. We're going to be doing it straight from the PC. It's a easy steps but make sure you follow it step by step and take your time while doing it. No rush. Now on the bottom left corner of the screen you would see a small box. When you click on that it will open up the ease access mode. So in this steps what we're going to be using we're going to be changing this shortcut from instead of opening ease access and we're going to change it to be able to open up the command screen so we can be able to access the computer and change the admin password so first thing what we want to do is we're going to restart the computer while it's restarting we're going to press and hold on the power button in order to trigger an error message so we can open up the repair mode so right now we're doing the steps where while it's restarting, we're going to press the arrow key to force shut off the computer or laptop. Right here it's off, then we're going to turn it back on, then wait for it to start booting up. Then we're going to do the same thing, we're to hold the power key again for about like 3-5 seconds to force shut off the PC. Then again go ahead and turn it on. So right now what would happen is it will take us to the screen where we're gonna do the start of the repair in order for to move further with the process. So right here you'll see launch startup repair recommended. When you see this you want to click the enter key on the keyboard for it to start the repair process. We're not going to do the repair we're just gonna get to that screen in order to access the computer files. take a minute to run that diagnostic once you get to this uh, startup repair screen you can just hit cancel we're not going to do the repair this screen right here it will be running some diagnostic on the PC or laptop for about maybe up to an hour so just be patient once you get to the screen right here what we're going to do, we're going to click on that arrow to open up, the, to view the uh, problem details. So go ahead and click on that arrow right now. Once you click on that arrow, we want to scroll all the way down to the bottom of the screen or this page. Then we're going to be picking on the second link. When you, when you click on the second link, it will open up the notepad. And this notepad basically is going to get us access into the laptop files where we're going to be able to change some things in order to reset the admin password. So what you want to do next, you want to go on the top left corner, click on file. Then we're going to scroll down to open. Once you open up that screen, you want to double click on computer. Then we're going to go with the Windows D partition of this laptop. On your PC, it may be different partition, but on mine, it's going to be the D file. Once you do that, you want to double click, you want to open up the Windows file. Then after we go to the Windows file, which is the last one on the bottom, we're going to be looking for a different file inside there. So double click on this. Then you want to scroll down to the S. You want to look for System32. So keep scrolling down. Then you want to open up that file. Double click on that one. 
Once you are inside the system32 file, we're going to be looking at the says where it says file of type. We're going to click on the arrow so we can pick to view all files because the file we're going to be looking for is going to be a different format than the other regular files and that's how we're going to get access to that one. So the file we're going to be looking for is called utilman. It's a long list so we're going to be scrolling down to find that file utilman and that utilman is basically is the ease access file that I showed you earlier in this video. So what we're going to be doing basically is replacing the ease access mode with the command option in order to open up the command screen where we can change the um, the access, the easy access basically. So click on the right on this file then rename. What we're going to do is just going to type in utilman then just the, le the number 2 to it. Then click anywhere else basically to make that change. So our next step is to look for a command which is cmd. Once you find cmd you want to right click with the mouse on that file and you want to make a copy of this one. So scroll down to copy and once you created the copy click paste. When you paste that file you want to rename it to utilman. So that way when we restart the computer or laptop and we click on that box it will take us to command screen then we're going to type in a command in order to open up the page where we're going to reset the password for that for this PC or laptop. So once you change it make sure the name exactly the same the letter U is capital same as the other file once you do that just click anywhere to make that save change then you can go ahead and hit cancel right here then you can close out everything else that was opened. So once you click everything you can just either hit cancel to restart or just finish. If you hit finish it's gonna shut off the laptop and you can go ahead and press the power to reopen or turn that back on. If you hit to cancel earlier it will just tell you if you want to restart the laptop. So let's go ahead and turn it back on. Once the laptop is completely turned on, what we're going to be doing right now, we're going to click on that box on the left corner to open up the command screen. Basically, this will, as you see just right here, it just opened up the command screen instead of the ease access. So what we're going to do next right now, we're going to be typing in the command, which is control space user passwords 2. Once you do that go ahead and click the enter on the keyboard then it will open up this right here which is exactly what we need in order to either reset the password or remove the passwords. So we're going to be picking the administrator the profile that we want to change the passcode on we're gonna change the password just something easy I'm just gonna do one two three four five then click underneath where you wanna confirm the passcode same thing you wanna retype it one two three four five once you are done you can go ahead and click OK then OK on the bottom then you can go ahead and close out the command uh, screen Go ahead and click on the administrator profile then you can go ahead and type in the password one two three and four five then click enter on the keyboard as you guys see we got the steps done and it was successful we got the password changed on the admin profile for this laptop 
I hope this video was helpful to you. If it was, make sure to hit the like and subscribe to my channel to support the channel more. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time.